I'm Richie Torres uh, from Bronx, New York in the United States. I'm a member of the New York City Council, which is the sole legislature of New York City. Uh, and within the council, I chair the committee that oversees the New York City Housing Authority, which manages the largest stock of public housing in, in North America. It's a historic occasion for social democrats and progressives from across the world to come together and share our experiences and our common struggles and figure out how we can collaborate across national boundaries. We should no longer confine ourselves to our own homes, but we should be finding partners throughout the globe. You know, our, our president in the United States, Donald Trump, is not only a threat to everything we believe in in the United States, he's a threat to the liberal democratic order throughout the globe. And so the urgency for partnership and collaboration is stronger than ever before. Well, I'm a member of the Progressive Caucus, and the Progressive Caucus in 2013, uh, when I was first elected, was able in, to make the first Latina the Speaker of the New York City Council. It's the second most powerful position in New York City government. And we've been able to advance uh, an unabashedly progressive agenda, which has included the closing of a facility known as Rikers Island, uh, which had come to be a symbol of, of how cruel and corrupt our criminal justice system had become. Uh, and I'm proud that the City Council has been at the forefront of driving the closing of Rikers Island. Municipalities are the most local level of government. Right? It's, it's the level of government that people feel and see uh, up close. And it also happens to be the most progressive. Uh, I, I think the examples that we set at the local level can become the standard, not only nationwide, but throughout the world. 